Welcome to this week's episode of Rocco's Reviews. I'm your host, Jason Rocco. At this year's Consumer Electronics Show, wearables were all the rage. The popularity of the Nike Fuel Band, Pebble Watch, and now the Apple Watch have brought wearables to the mainstream. Now, wearables are moving from your wrist to your face. Google Glass, which I previously reviewed at two and a half stars, was the first smart eyewear. Now, the Jet by Recon Instruments is the newest player in this emerging market. The quick and easy description of the Jet would be Google Glass for the modern athlete, but that would be an insult to the good people at Recon. The Jet was designed with strenuous activities such as cycling and running to mind. No need to fiddle with the buttons or navigate lengthy menu chains. The data you want is right there, in your line of sight without blocking the view. Whereas Glass is dependent on your phone or Wi-Fi for 95% of its tasks, Jet has built-in GPS and motion tracking to guide you on your trip. The glass has many sensors including accelerometer, gyroscope, altimeter, barometer, and magnetometer. So many, so many ometers. You can also hook the Jet up to pretty much any Ant Plus or Bluetooth device for additional data. The screen, just in this little, little arm right here, as you can see, is the equivalent of a 30 inch screen from seven feet away. Is much easier to quickly focus on than Glass's transparent display. Battery life is just under four hours for the Jet, but if you do run out of juice while on the trail, Jet features swappable batteries, which just pop out, and they're right here. It also helps the device be, be counterweighted, very comfortable. The lens are also easy to pop out, just in case you need to change, change the lens color. They have clear, they have the sunglass shade, and in between. Well, on a bike ride, you can check your speed, pace, change in elevation, as well as map for reaching your live location. When you get home, you can upload the data to the Engage software and analyze your activities and compare it to your friends. Photo quality from the Jet is reminiscent of camera phones from 2007. Decent, but not likely to become your primary shooter. It is more than enough, though, to capture a quick shot while out on the road without having to dig into your pack for your phone. Google Glass, let me get these right here. Google Glass, very dorky looking. You know, you're out and about wearing these, you're gonna get a lot of, a lot of negative attention. While not the most stylish accessory, the Jet will not stick out that much when you're on the trail or the open road. Fits the cycling world very well and is actually pretty comfortable to wear. Only slightly heavier than regular sunglasses. The Jet features open API, but since its release in mid-April, only one third party app has hit the market. This is the only knock against the Recon Jet glasses, which I'm giving four and a half out of five stars. Available now for the retail price of $6.99. This has been another Rocco's Reviews episode. Have questions or want, want more tech news? Feel free to follow me on Twitter at Jason W. Rocco. Thank you and have a great day.